Hello, and welcome to a brief overview of the Saskatchewan Snowmobile Association. The SSA is a nonprofit organization focused on developing, maintaining, and promoting safe, responsible, on trail snowmobiling in Saskatchewan. The SSA was formed in 1971, originally made up of volunteers, dealers, and manufacturer representatives to deal with issues facing snowmobiling at the time. Today, we've grown to include over 60 snowmobile clubs, comprised of over 2,000 members responsible for maintaining over 11,000 kilometers of fully signed and groomed trails, complete with more than 250 warm-up shelters. In order to utilize this trail system, you must register your snowmobile, and it's through these registrations that the bulk of our funds are raised. The cost to register your sled is $189, consisting of a $110 registration fee and a $79 proratable insurance premium. These registration dollars are collected and dispersed to our clubs based on various metrics we track throughout the season. Unfortunately, the sad reality is that these registration dollars alone only cover about half the cost of maintaining the trail system. Things like grooming equipment, fuel, repairs, pre- and post-season clearing of trails, and shelter upkeep, just to name a few, are all very expensive. To raise the remaining funds, our clubs hold various fundraising events in their communities. Things like snowmobile rallies, raffles, etc. We at the SSA also hold similar fundraisers, but on a more provincial scale. An annual trade show, a sled raffle, and assist in a provincial snowmobile festival. Of the registration fees collected, over 80% goes to the club, with the remaining going to administration, marketing, safety, and insurance. How much each club gets depends on multiple factors kilometers groomed, expenses, trail evaluation scores, and more. Did you know anyone born on or after January 1st, 1989 in Saskatchewan is required by law to complete a snowmobile safety course to legally operate a snowmobile? Without it, you could be charged and your insurance may be invalid. Luckily, you have two options of study available to you, online or in person. The in-person classroom style training is a single six hour class. The online training is done through an online account that allows you to work at your own pace, logging in and out as you please, but lacks the direct support a certified safety instructor can provide. Don't know? Don't go. The SSA has been promoting this message for a long time. Our clubs work with landowners to get authorization to use their land. However, it's important to remember that while we are permitted to groom and ride on the trails, that is where the permissions end. Any off-trail riding on private land without permission is trespassing. Every year we lose permission due to trespassing, though primarily trespassing happens in the off-season by tracked vehicles that are more destructive to property. So regardless of whether you ride a snowmobile in the winter, a side-by-side -side in the summer, or a truck in the fall, it's important to remember that trespassing isn't a victimless crime. The truth is, without these landowners, there is no trail system. So always respect their property and never ride off trail unless you are permitted to do so. To view our trail system and get the latest updates on grooming information, please visit our interactive map. Some of the biggest external issues we face are trail system sustainability through registrations, land use permissions, and a lack of volunteers. As mentioned, snowmobile registrations do not cover the costs of maintaining the provincial trail system, resulting in many clubs lacking the funds needed to upgrade their aging equipment. This, in turn, increases the workload of the volunteers who either must complete the repairs themselves or attempt to work with less than adequate equipment. Our goal has always been to increase registrations to a level that supports and sustains the trail system. Ensuring snowmobiling remains a vibrant, safe, attractive, and profitable activity in the province. On average, snowmobiling has a $242.3 million impact on the province and contributes to over 4,200 jobs. A more sustainable trail system means we can continue to provide economic and social benefits for many years to come.